Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Adventures Red Chapter. Last episode we did the Mirage Tower and Timekeeper bonus chapters, which was kind of crazy. So we got a Mirage Mew, but we actually um, reset the game because during the Timekeeper quest, we can actually alter time. So that's what we're going to do in today's episode. We're going to basically redo what we did last episode. So we're going to just like power through the, uh, the first bit. So if we go from Pumelo all the way east, I'm going to try and avoid this one battle as well because that guy is really annoying. So come back over here and we're going to use Whirlpool on the Whirlpools here. Get to Mirage Island and if we go up here we find this girl. So if you want to see like what happens with this, obviously watch last episode because we did this. We basically want to get to a certain point we did last episode to change history. We're going to basically save Pink. Because if you remember, well I say save Pink, like her face isn't going to get burnt like it was um, before. But that might save her in the long run because obviously no burnt face, she might not turn to the evil side and then obviously all the events might not happen so things are about to get a little bit different which uh, I'm actually kind of excited to see. So we've got all these um, flashbacks, well I say flashbacks, like all these visions and stuff of different timelines. We do want to go and get this though, I'm not sure what it's used for just yet. It's a dark crest which uh, is used to change the form of a certain Pokemon. Don't know what at the moment but when we do find out and if we do get the Pokemon we're definitely going to be using it. So almost there, and then there's an item over here we cannot pick up. Bit glitched, but there is an item there. So uh, there's where blue gets taken in the past. And then I think we find out about her past next. And the, f the vision after that is when um, we can potentially change the course of history change reality as we know it. Right, yeah, so this is what happened to her. Her parents got killed by Hooper and Darkrai and Regigigas, which is not good. Right, so then the next one is when things are going to change, which uh, hopefully makes a new bonus chapter or something for us to do. We will see. So here it is. So what's your reason? Pink. Ah, intervening now will alter this timeline. Do you want to intervene? And this time we are going to say yes. She gave up everything for me. I must save her. I'm truly disappointed in you. You've made the wrong choice again. I thought you were changed this time, huh? Oh, Rodan, what's that? Oh, it's like a real life Aerodactyl. <laughs> It's like uh, what Eridek looked like before it became a fossil, and it's maybe like fire rock, fire fly on the suit. It's got to be part fire because of the fire wings, but let's try thunder. Flare blitz, okie dokie. Right, just gonna one shot me, that's, that's great. <laughs> Alright, let's go for a surf. Shadow claw, that's fine. Oh, okay. Uh, let's get waterfall. Might be a little bit better. Gig impact. There's a bit of damage, but we fine, we fine. Come on, finish it off, finish it off. Nice. Critical hit. Hey, I'll take that. A guy Dora? No idea what this is. Oh, it's like a like a Hydreigon, but a bit like a different one. <laughs> Okay, Thunder, yeah, we are definitely going to die here. Unless we want to live, that'd be great. No. No chance. Alright, what do we go do against, like, Gaidora? Gonna go into Venusaur. We'll just Mega and maybe try Earthquake if you're not part of Flying. That'll be good. I'm so glad Megas are back in this game, man. I love Mega Revolution. So sweet. Outrage, please don't do too much damage. Oh, that's not, that's not bad. And we can land the, land the Earthquake. That's great. Oh, it sounded like it was super effective. Go on, keep going, keep going. All well, that damage is nice. Oh, keep going. Put into the red. Can we, can we take it out? Hey, critical hit. Let's go. Oh, you love to see it. Ah, oh, so nice. 
a Mothra. Mothra. I'm gonna assume it's a bug? Because of moth? Oh, that looks so pretty, dude! Oh, that looks amazing! Oh, that's gotta be like bug something, right? It's gonna rock slide. Oh, that looks so I love that, man. That looks really cool. Yeah, definitely super effective, nice. If we don't take it out, flinch it. Oh, go on. One shot it, one shot it, one shot it. Oh, flinch it, flinch it, flinch it, flinch it. Ah, okay, quiver dance. That's a, that's a little scary, but one more rock slide, we should be fine and. It's glowing. As long as we don't miss, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Whew. That was a little scary. Zilla. No idea. Oh. Maybe put electric? I don't know. Let's try an iron head. That's not very effective. Okay, I have no idea what type this is. Not very effective. That's gonna hurt a lot. Uh, just gonna go for a rock slide. We can keep flinching it. Flinch? No fl Oh, you missed? Okay, uh, let's try a hyper beam. Why not? That's not, that's not bad. <laughs> Alright, come on, Gyarados, you got this. Uh, Hydro Pump? Come on. Oh, it barely does anything, dude! Just glad you missed the stone edges. And we missed the Hydro Pump, you gotta recharge. And we miss. You land that one, we're dead. Oh, it's not looking great, not looking great. Come on, Earthquake, finish it off. Come on. Yeah, dude. She was tough. She was very tough. I'm sorry. You may think your actions are noble. And there's nothing more than a, a thin veil of selfishness. What you're doing will have grave consequences. I don't care. We'll see. What? Red? Red? Get away from her. I'm gonna battle Brown. Alright. Uh, problem is, I'm a little bit weak right now. I've got max revive, so I'm fine. But it's level 75, oh, we've got this easy. If all this Pokemon level 75, we'll just earthquake everything. It's all good. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> hey, I was getting a little bit worried then, but... Obviously, at the time this happened, he shouldn't have a little 160s. It's so be good. Just keep earthquaking! As long as it doesn't have a flying type, we're fine. Sweet! Uh, Tangle. So we've got three Pokemon left. Like, I love the evolution of, like, this custom evolution, but at the same time, it creeps me out a little bit just because the smile. <laughs> The smile, you can't see its eyes, it's just, it's very creepy. Very, very creepy. I'm almost at 161, that's... I feel like it's gonna take a long time to uh, actually level up now. Nice, because obviously we know max level is 255, so... Whew. That's gonna take a long, long time to get there. A dust Bell. Oh, I remember you now. Very cute. And goodbye. Get destroyed. So what's gonna happen next? See you, Brown. Thank you, Red. What happened? You altered time. Thanks to your actions. You successfully ruined the lives of four people you know. What? Guron never defected from the Pokemon Association, so he died in action during the fiasco in Pomelo Island. That also means you ruined the life of his daughter? She is now an orphan. N no. That's not all. Your friends, Rudy, Blue, and Luca, 
They also died in this timeline. Hope you're satisfied. I didn't know. Actions have consequences. You'll never step foot on this island again. End of time gear bonus chapter. Oh, snap! Well, that's not good. So, Blue's dead. But... Oh. Hey, Red. Pink. Thank you for saving me. Don't worry about it. I'm just glad I'm there before Brown hurt you. It's not just that. I feel like you somehow saved me from dying. Huh? I can't explain it. But I had this nightmare last night that I was eaten by Cyborg Ariados. I don't know. It was weird. Oh, that's kind of messed up, man. Have you spoken to Brown? Red, that's not funny. What? I told you about my nightmare just then. Now you're trying to tease me by saying whether I've spoken to Brown? May his soul rest in peace. I'll see you around, Red. Oh, snap. Brown's dead? Didn't Brown die anyway? Oh, snap. Let's try to find, um, pink again, see if there's anything else we can do. Otherwise, I've got to, like, restart, because, uh, Obviously, time is uh, messed up a little bit. I don't think we want this timeline. Oh, Pink's right there. Keep getting this nightmare of a dark being telling me that I shouldn't be here right now. Ooh, that's not good. And I think if we go in here as well, for sale. Because obviously, Blues doesn't live here anymore. Pink, what are you doing, Blues? I, I don't know. Been having nightmares, you know? What do you mean? I don't know, but it's like, it's like I wasn't meant to be here. I've never spoken to Blue, but but I feel like I have this feeling like I took something from her. Come on, Pink, let's go. Are you alright? Rind Island. Oh, I, I died in Rind Island. You're hallucinating. Where are you going? I'm heading to Rind Island. Wait, Pink. Untold Truth bonus chapter. Ooh. So maybe if we get this like bonus chapter done, like time will go back to normal, maybe? So let's, oh, okay, guy's not there to fast travel, I have to get to the orange archipelago, so I'm going to have to run all the way to a teleport guy, but I'll see you guys um, when we get to the orange archipelago. Alright, so the orange archipelago, because the teleport guy wasn't there for me, so I had to run all the way to the uh, Million City, but where do I want to go? We want to go to Rind Island. I'm assuming we're going to go to where it all happened, which I think's... Yeah, over here. So if we pop a repel. And just get to the events, which I think is just across this bridge, and then there's another bridge over here. And there should be one more bridge, and hopefully Pink will be there, because bring back bad memories, man. Bring back bad memories. Wait, there's a pit. Up here a little bit more. Where is it? It's gotta be around here somewhere. Looking for the pit that. There it is, there she is. Okay. She came to the place where she died. Oh dude, that, that chapter when we got to it was messed up, man. Horrible way to go. Miss Pink. Miss Pink so much. Yo. Pink. I died here. <laughs> what are you talking about? I remember everything. There's a voice in my head. It keeps telling me that I'm not meant to be alive and that you did something. What did you do? I had to. You're my friend. I went to an island and altered time, so you're... What about Brown, Blue, and the others? I didn't know they'd end up dying in the process. I did it. I killed them. Pink. Thank you for rescuing me, Red. But I don't want to ever talk to you again. I, I can't. Oh, snap. Okay. So is that it? That's not... No, that's definitely not worth it. So I'm definitely not going to save the game. Like, I wonder if we can maybe go back to um, Mirage Island and talk to the timekeeper. Maybe let her know that we know we now made a mistake and stop what we did before, maybe? that makes sense. Um, I can always see and try and give it a go. Right, so I'm gonna cut back to Mirage Island and see what happens. So I'll see you guys 
in a little bit. All right, we're back. So let's see what happens next. If we go in here, can we find her? I'm like, yo, I'm sorry I made a mistake. Just popping out for a repel just in case. If not, I'll just restart the game and just, um, obviously I didn't want to just see. I can't put that up yet. Let's see what happens if we save pink. And if we save pink, people die and she doesn't want to speak to us no more. Not great, is it? <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, there she is, yo. Ah. Crashes the game if you uh, speak to her. So that's what happens if you save pink. Luckily, uh, we're gonna, you know, reset. I, I, it's nice to see that what happens if you did save her, but we, it, it's better if we um, don't save her, because maybe we miss some bonus chapters with blue or stuff. It feels like things will get cut, you know, so. Um, next episode, we're gonna play as if we what we did last episode happened. We're gonna have to redo that chapter again, which wasn't so bad. It was actually kind of easy. And then next episode, we'll find something brand new to do. So hopefully, you guys enjoyed and got to see what happens when you save Pink. And just I would not save her personally unless something else happens. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.